Hello guys, my name is Shahid and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk about one of the most popular messaging application in the world. If you ever been to Thailand, you will probably know what I'm talking about. Yes, you guess it right. We will talk about Line today. So the first thing guys we will do is to install the application. If you don't have the application in your phone, just go to the Play Store and in the search bar you will search Line. Here you can find the line application very easily and then you can press on install. So as you can see I already have the application installed in my phone so I will just click on open. So when we open the application this is the first interface you will see of the line application here. As you can see there are two options down there. One is login and the other one is sign up. So if you already have an account you will just click on sign in and then Put your user id and password and you can log in but if you don't have an account then you will press on sign up for a new account so we will create a new account so we need to press on sign up so when we press on sign up uh, the next page will show what's the phone number for this device so it means that you need to put your valid phone number here uh, the number which don't have any account online uh, existing account so uh, I will just click on the continue here you will see you will you will need to select the country where you're staying and then the other thing is that you should select the phone number so as I'm living in Thailand right now so I will select Thailand and then I will put the phone number here as you can see I put the phone number and there is a message popped up it says that uh, we will send a verification code on this number the number you just put in so the number should be valid I repeat that the number should be valid because you will receive an SMS from a text message from uh, lines uh, there will be a verification code so uh, sometimes the verification code is filled auto filled like as you can see on your screen here but sometimes you need to fill it if the sim card is in another phone so you need to fill it after verifying your phone number then the next step is that restore chat history if this number was used for any line account before so you can restore your chat history but we will create a new account so we will skip this part so the next thing is start adding friends in start adding friends you will see two options auto add friends allow others to add me so you need to choose uh, if you have a contact list and you know there are many people who are on the line application they have accounts so line will access to your contact list and find friends who are already on line application so they will just auto edit it they will send invitation the other option is allow others to add me is that the people can add you by the phone number the number you just chose so they can add you by your phone number later on you can create an id i will tell you how to create but here so i will choose only allow others to add me and i will click on the arrow below so guys the next step is to agree to the policy of line just click on agree and on the next page just click on ok and here when you click on OK uh, the line application will need to access to the device location so you can allow all the time allow only while using the application or deny it so uh, allow only while using the application you can choose any of the three options so I will choose allow all the time and proceed to the next and then we are ready to go your account has been created So guys this is how the first page of the application when you already created your account i will tell you some cool features so stay tuned to the video so guys let's talk about some features of line application so first of all the first thing is you can see this is the home page of line application where you on the top you can see uh, the profile and the first feature I want to show you that how to create a group online application as you can see there is an option like create a group you will click on create a group and here you will see uh, your contact list the friends that you already have online so uh, just choose a few of your friend the one you want to 
the one you want them to be in that group. Once you select them, just click on next. And when you click on next, then there is another option where you can select the name of the group. I will just name it like games. And from here, you can even select uh, the different options are here, or even you can go down there and choose from the device. You can choose any picture from your device or take a picture, use your camera, or you can use these uh, profile pictures, which already in line application. So once you have chosen all those things, then just click on the create group options and your group will be created and an invitation will be sent to the all the people you have selected then they can join accept it or deny it so this is how you can create a group the other option is open chat this is a very cool feature in line application as you can see there are many categories in open chat there are chat rooms where you can just join them and then chat so i will just click on the study once you click on the studies, there are many chat rooms that you can join and the one you want to join, just click on it. Uh, not this one, this one needs a request. I just want to show you here. So this one, you can just click on the join and here you can even select a different name, a nickname. So I will select this one and then you can even select a different picture from here, the one which is actually not your profile picture. You can select a different picture to join an open chat room. This is also a very cool thing. So then you can click on join. When you click on join, you actually join the, the room and here you can just send your messages and, and talk to many people who are in this chat room and not your contact list. So this is a very cool feature in line application. So guys moving forward as you can see there are many options at the bottom as you can see home chats and timeline so we will go to the timeline here as you can see there are an option at the top which is called add story so you can actually add pictures uh, to your stories as well once you click on the add stories here you will see that you can even capture a video you can e even take a picture and can add a text as well so once if you want to take um, a picture just click on it and the picture will be taken there are an option at the top where you can just add some text into your picture you can draw something and then you can add some stickers which are really cool as well so there are many um, cool features in this thing where you can add to your story picture so once you have done, you can just click on the arrow at the bottom and it will be posted and your story will be there for 24 hours. So this is how you can post your story. The other thing is that you want to post something to your timeline. As you can see here, many people have posted the, the friends which are doing their activities on the timeline. You can see them. So here, just click on the plus sign at the bottom. Uh, here you can see options like relay camera and write so if you click on camera so the camera will be open and as you can see here are like videos and you can make a, a video or a photo as well so once you click a picture so there will be again um, option at the top you can add text you can um, just crop your picture and then you can draw something and then you can add some stickers to your pictures as well so once you have done you can click on the arrow to edit to your timeline or if you don't want to edit to your timeline there is an option at the bottom at the left where you can just save this picture to your device as well so this is how you can add pictures to your timeline guys i hope you liked the video for more videos stay tuned to the channel and please like and subscribe the channel thank you so much